Welcome back. This is Wendy Williams with Williams Educational Consultants. I hope everybody's having a great day. I just wanted to jump in real quick and say congratulations to the class of 2021 who took advantage of the early action deadline of October 15th and submitted their applications. Hopefully there were no glitches and everything was seamless. But now that those applications are gone, please don't forget you still have a few things to do. First thing is you want to make sure that your college of choice has received all the required documents from standardized testing to transcript to teacher recommendations, even your application fee. So make sure that you verify that. Often colleges send emails to students saying that they have received the application with access to their own portal for that university. So be sure you log in and check your portal for the application status. The second thing is you want to go ahead and talk to the colleges about visiting if you have not visited already. Now due to COVID-19, it might be a little bit more difficult, but reach out to the schools and see about college visits. The third thing is the scholarships. So be sure as a family that you complete the FAFSA, which is the federal aid application and then the CSS profile, which is the institutional aid, and not every school requires the CSS profile or recommends it. But if you would go to CSS profile through collegeboard.org, you will find out if the college of choice that you apply to needs that form. So that's the FAFSA and the CSS profile, two separate forms. And then last but not least, scholarships. Now is a great time to research schools and their scholarships. For example, the best way to research these schools is to go to the financial aid department on each university's website. So University of South Carolina financial aid. If you Google that, it'll take you straight to the financial aid department and show you scholarships and other aids and grants that are provided from those institutions. As always, if you need anything, reach out to Wendy Williams with Williams Educational Consultants. And don't forget to join the YouTube channel for Wendy Williams for updates. I try to make them often and I look forward to bringing you some new information here in the next few weeks. Thanks for joining. Take care. Bye-bye.